new major scales, A, E flat, and B flat. Remember the pattern of whole tones and semitones we need to use to build a major scale? Just for reference, here's how they appear in the C major scale, which just happens to use the white keys. In order to build any major scale, we need that same pattern. Tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone. So what notes will we end up with if, for example, we want to build a major scale over A and not C? If you're near a keyboard, pause this video and see if you can build a major scale starting on A yourself first. Hopefully, you ended up with something like this. In order to keep the same pattern of tones and semitones, we need to use some black keys, here written as sharps so that we are using every letter name once. How many black keys do we have? Yes, they are C-sharp, F-sharp, and G-sharp. So what do you think the key signature for A major will look like? Well, it will look like this. There are our three black keys, the three sharps. Great. Now let's do the same thing for the key of B flat. First, if you have a keyboard near you, find B flat and build the scale yourself using the tone, tone, semitone, tone, 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 semitone pattern. Feel free to pause the video. I'll still be here when you return. You should end up with something like this. Now, how many black keys do we have? You should have just two. B flat, obviously, as well as E flat. Why don't we have sharps in this key? Well, to make sure we have every letter name in the scale, the note names need to have some kind of B, C, D, E, F, G, A, B in that order. So, if we tried to use, say, D sharp instead of E flat, then we'd have B flat, C, D, D sharp, F, G, A, B flat, and E would be completely missing. So that wouldn't be the right spelling for a major scale. It needs to be E flat, so we have some kind of E in there and have the complete list of letter names. Thus, we'll end up with a key signature that looks like this, containing B flat and E flat. Now, let's build the last new major scale we'll need for grade two, E flat major. See if you can build it yourself first by finding E flat and going up from there. Hopefully you ended up with this. As with B flat, we have to use flats so we can have every letter name represented in the scale. Thus, the key signature will look like this since we have three flat notes. Mm -hmm.